Hi, I'm Alex from Aircon Reviews, and today we're going to be reviewing the Samsung wall mounted split systems. The chassis size on this is around about 800 mm in width, and after that, going up to your 5 to your 8 kilowatt range is typically around 1 meter in width. Now we're going to have a look at the remote control. Again, this comes standard with most brands of wall split systems. Now, with this remote, it doesn't actually come with a backlight, and as you can see, the display screen is slightly on the small side. One good feature about this remote is, is the fact that they use words instead of symbols. So as you change them from different modes, it uses the word cool and heat instead of showing a snowflake or a sun. This remote comes with most of its standard functions like sleep mode, your timers, quiet mode and auto fan speed. One good feature which I do like about this system is it has a mode called good sleep mode. And what that means is it automatically adjusts the airflow direction and the fan speed to help provide a comfortable environment while you sleep at the preset temperature and operating time set by you. Now we're going to take a look at the unit filter, okay? So to do so, all you do is, is lift the front bit up like so, and the whole thing pulls away, which is pretty easy to do. Now the filters are actually attached to the inside of the lid, which I find quite good. All we need to do to remove them is like this, which again, I find is pretty easy to remove. And just remembering that every six months, make sure you remove the filters, take them outside and use a hose to wash them down and let them dry. And then all we need to do to put them back in, is just slide back in, Make sure they're clipped in, lift it up, slide the lid back across and pop it in. Okay, so now we're going to switch the unit on and check the fan speeds on the indoor units. We'll give it a test on high to see how loud it is and then we'll give it a test on a low fan speed and see how quiet it is for you. Okay, so here we go. So the unit is now switching on. And again, to start off with, we'll test it in a high fan speed. So that's now running at full blast. Overall, that's a pretty quiet fan. Minimal noise coming out of it, which is great. Now we'll turn the fan speed down and check it on a low fan speed. Now this is running on a low fan speed. To me, that is very quiet. Minimal sound is coming from it and you would barely be able to even tell that the unit is switched on. Overall, comparing the fan speed on high and low, I find the overall product very good and very quiet, which is good for the consumer. Now we're gonna take a look at the outdoor condenser units. Again, most chassis sizes are pretty similar across all brands of aircon. The sound power level on this 3.5 kilowatt unit has a 64 decibel reading, which is not the quietest and is slightly a little bit higher than some of the other units that are out there. And lastly, just to let you know, the overall quality of this product feels pretty sturdy. Let's check the quick specs on the 3.5 kilowatt split model. So the energy efficiency rating on this particular model is a little lower than some other brands with only a 2.5 star rating on cooling and a 3 star energy efficiency rating on heating. Samsung comes with a standard industrial 5 years parts and labour warranty. Also their warranty work is done by a local company which is here in WA. The availability on their spare parts I found are really easy to get hold of as a lot of the stock is available here in WA. So to summarise the Samsung wall split units, I find this overall as an average system. The hand remote could be a little bit bigger and the outdoor unit could be a little bit smaller. But the overall build quality of the unit seems pretty good. I'm Alex from Aircon Reviews and I hope that you've enjoyed this review today. Visit our website if you wish to review more brands of air conditioning units.